Rebecca. I'm from the University of Vermont Medical Center, and today I'm bringing you a 15-minute standing um, aerobic exercise um, to get your heart rate up. So all you need to do is tie up your shoes, move some furniture out of the way, and uh, get some water right beside you, and we'll get started. So first we're gonna do high knees, so we're just gonna warm up the body nice and easy. So nothing too fast. I'm just bringing the knee up, pulling the core in. So I'm standing up nice and tall. Lift it up, pulling in each time I lift the knee. You can hold on to something if you need to for balance. Um, I have this guy beside me. You could grab the wall and do some lifts. And last one, great. Good morning, so your hands are gonna be back. Elbows are pushed back, so you're squeezing your shoulder blades and you're gonna hinge at the hips and then you're gonna lift yourself back up and squeeze your butt at the top, okay? So your legs don't really bend, you're, you're hinging so they're staying straight and I'm getting a nice stretch in the hamstrings while I'm really stretching out the front of the chest here as well. And I'm pulling the belly button in as I'm lifting up. So you can really choose kind of the depth you go. If it's right here, that's okay. Last one. And we'll move on. Okay. So we're going to do step backs. So I'm going to step back. So I get a stretch right here in the front of the thigh. And I'm going to lift my arms up. And I'm going to twist to the opposite leg, the one that's in front and back forward, and I'm gonna step back forward. Other side, so I get my balance first. Twist, so I'm turning with my hands, with my head, and then coming back as one. Okay, so the hands kind of stay right near the ears. Set myself, twist, and back forward. Again, if you need to hold on, one arm coming up is fine, and twist. And the other side. Okay, so next we're gonna do pickups to overhead. So I'm gonna widen my legs just a little bit and I am gonna bend my knees, like I'm gonna pick up a box and put it up overhead. So I'm keeping my back pretty flat. I'm looking kind of straight ahead. And you can start to raise up the heels if you'd like to to get a little bit bigger reach. You also don't have to go down as far. Maybe the box is right in the middle and you grab it and put it up overhead from the side. You're coming down and lifting up. So what we don't want is this to pick up. You wanna keep your hips down, your chest is forward and lift up. Good. And then the last one are side taps. So I'm gonna go out with my right foot and I'm gonna lean to stretch out the side of the body here. So right leg, right arm comes up overhead. Last one. And let's switch sides. So this is the last warm up exercise and we'll get right into it. Kenny Loggins came to say hey. <laughs> Awesome. Um, so what we're going to do is um, seven exercises and we're going to rotate through them. You're going to do the exercise for 30 seconds and then you're going to have a 10 second break. Okay. And kind of catch your breath and get ready for the next exercise. Um, so I'm going to explain what we're going to be doing um, as we go, I think, just to kind of keep this going. So I have the time.
jump off the ground, but instead I'm only just doing a calf raise. But I'm just powering my body up. Okay? How are we doing? <laughs> so the talk test is a really good way to see if you're working or not. So as you can tell, taking breaths in between my sentences, um, which would put me kind of right in that middle category of a somewhat hard exercise, um, which is great. Here we go. Sorry about that. So high knees are next. So you are picking the pace up. So remember in the beginning, we are just trying to warm the body up, but now we're a little bit warm, hopefully. I'm not alone in that. And you're lifting up the knees. And I am adding a little bit of a twist. You don't have to if you want to stay forward and just work on the speed of lifting your feet up. Or you can start to add a little bit of a tap back and forth. Okay, last one is push-ups. So I'm going to use the mantle here. You can use the wall. You can use a table, something sturdy. Here we go. So we're going to go down and up. Okay, so trying to keep your shoulders down, so I'm not coming up like this. So I'm straight as a board, hopefully. Coming down and pushing back up. So a good thing is to exhale as you push up, inhale on the way down, inhale, and exhale. Inhale, and exhale. Hopefully we got a couple more seconds left. Right on time. <laughs> Okay, so that was the first round. So grab a drink of water, um, and you can modify any of those um, for the next round. So think about the intensity that you just did. Think about how you're feeling. So you can take your heart rate, your, your pulse, maybe you have one of those fancy watches that tells you what your heart rate is, um, and see where you wanna go from there. So you already press play, so you're already here. We've got, I think, what do we got left? We've got five and a half minutes left. And then you're done. So see if you can crank it up just a little bit. I'm gonna try. My talking might go down, which might be nice for you. Um, but I'm working out too, so we're gonna do it. So first is jacks. Um, remembering stepping out to the side. And then we have our side steps with the squat. We have our one-sided step backs with a reach. And maybe if you didn't do the reaches before, maybe try to add the arms. So the more we use our upper body, your heart rate will increase. And the power ups, maybe try to add a calf raise. If you're not quite there, we gotta get going. Here we go. So we have our jacks first. But if you weren't quite there with the calf raise, you can always not add it in. You could always just do a one calf raise on one side, kind of like that. Um, and then with the high knees, maybe pick up the speed, maybe pick up the height of the knees and the push-ups. Those are tough. So just try to get through them for 30 seconds. Good. So you can even try to get a little lower if you wanted to. Maybe the next time you play this uh, video, maybe tomorrow. Um, so we have our step outs. I'm going to get ready. I'm going to go a little lower this time. So I'm going to step out and back in. Out, back in. So I'm not coming up as high, so I'm keeping my hips back. You're more than welcome to come up each time. I'm just trying to get a little bit more work in the thighs and in the legs and the butt. But you do what you want, right? No one's there to judge. I'm not judging, you press play, so I'm pretty proud already of you. All right, nice job. So then I'm gonna start with the right leg. Again, you can hold on if you need to or maybe something on this side, whichever works for you. Here we go. So back and up. So maybe start out slow and then speed it up as you feel balanced.